This video will cover beginner questions regarding the topic of trigonometric identities. Before learning verifying trigonometric identities, let's learn trigonometric identities as a preparation step. To simplify the trigonometric expression, we basically need to remember the eight trigonometric identities here. 1, 2, and 3 are the reciprocal identities. 4 and 5 are quotient identities. 6, 7, and 8 are Pythagorean identities. Shall we begin? Question 1. Sin theta over tangent theta is, we can think of it as sin theta times 1 over tangent theta equals sin theta times 1 over tangent theta is cotangent theta. Then sin theta times, we can read it as cosine theta over sine theta. Then sine theta is cancelled. The final answer is cosine theta. Question 2. Cosine theta times 1 over cotangent theta equals cosine theta times 1 over cotangent theta is tangent theta equals cosine theta times this one use the quotient identity sine theta over cosine theta equals cancelled the final answer is sine theta question 3 tangent theta times 1 over secant theta equals tangent theta times cosine theta then this one is sine theta over cosine theta times cosine theta. Then cosine theta is cancelled. The final answer is sine theta. Question 4. Cosecant theta is 1 over sine theta minus cosine theta times this one is cosine theta over sine theta equals 1 over sine theta minus make a fraction form then cosine squared theta over sine theta then make a single fraction 1 minus cosine squared theta over sine theta we know sine squared theta plus cosine squared theta equals 1, then move cosine squared theta to the right, then sine squared theta equals 1 minus cosine squared theta. The numerator is sine squared theta over sine theta, then final answer is sine theta. Secant theta is 1 over cosine theta minus tangent theta is sine theta over cosine theta times sine theta. Then make over 1. Then 1 over cosine theta minus sine squared theta over cosine theta. Then make one single fraction. 1 minus the sine squared the theta over cosine theta. Use the Pythagorean identity. Sine squared the theta plus cosine squared the theta equals 1. Then minus the sine squared the theta on each side. Cosine squared the theta equals 1 minus sine squared the theta. Then the numerator equals cosine squared theta over cosine theta. The final answer is cosine theta. If you've seen a problem and don't know how to simplify it, first change all expressions to sines or cosines. First one is 1 over sine theta plus 
cosine theta over sine theta times 1 minus cosine theta. Then make a single fraction. 1 plus cosine theta over sine theta times 1 minus cosine theta. Make the fraction form. Then a plus b times a minus b equals a squared minus b squared. So the numerator is a plus b times a minus b is a squared minus b squared, which is cosine squared theta over sine theta. Then sine squared theta plus cosine squared theta equals 1. Then minus cosine squared theta on each side. Then sine squared theta equals 1 minus cosine squared theta. Then the numerator equals sine squared theta over sine theta. The final answer is sine theta. Question 7. Cosecant theta is 1 over sine theta minus sine theta over cotangent squared theta is cosine squared theta over sine squared theta. Then times sine squared theta on each side. Expand. First one is cancelled. Sine theta minus second one is sine cubed theta over the denominator is cancelled, cosine squared theta. Then factor the numerator, take out sine theta, then times 1 minus sine squared theta over cosine squared theta equals sine theta times 1 minus sine squared theta is cosine squared theta. Then cosine squared theta is cancelled. The final answer is sine theta. Question 8. Tangent theta is sine theta over cosine theta times sine theta times cosine theta over sine theta plus cosine theta. Then make the fraction form. Sine theta over cosine theta times sine theta is cancelled. Then cosine theta over 1 is cosine theta plus another cosine theta makes 2 cosine theta. Then cosine theta is cancelled. The final answer is 2 sine theta. Question 9. Change all expressions to sine theta or cosine theta. Cosine theta times tangent theta is sine theta over cosine theta plus sine theta over 2 sine theta over cosine theta equals cosine theta is cancelled. Then sine theta plus sine theta is 2 sine theta over 2 sine theta over cosine theta. Then 2 is cancelled times cosine theta over cosine theta. Then the numerator is sine theta cosine theta over the denominator is cosine theta is cancelled. Then sine theta, the final answer is cosine theta. Question 10. Sine theta plus sine theta over cosine theta over 1 plus 1 over cosine theta times cosine theta over cosine theta equals 
The first one, sine theta times cosine theta plus second one, cosine theta is cancelled, then sine theta over the first one is cosine theta plus the second one is cancelled, then one. Then factor the numerator, take out sine theta times cosine theta plus one over cosine theta plus one. The common divisor is cancelled. Final answer is sine theta. Question 11. Secant theta is one over cosine theta minus cosine theta over tangent theta is sine theta over cosine theta. Then times cosine theta on each side. Then expand. First one is 1 minus second one is cosine squared theta over the denominator is cosine theta is cancelled. Sine theta equals sine squared theta plus cosine squared theta equals 1. Then minus cosine squared theta on each side. Cancelled. Sine squared theta equals 1 minus cosine squared theta. Then the numerator is sine squared theta over sine theta. The final answer is sine theta. Question 12. Cosine theta plus cotangent theta is cosine theta over sine theta over 1 plus 1 over sine theta. Then times sine theta on each side. Expand. The first one is cosine theta times sine theta. The second one is sine theta is cancelled. Cosine theta over the first one is sine theta plus second one, sine theta is cancelled, then one. Then back to the numerator, take out cosine theta, sine theta plus one over sine theta plus one. This one is cancelled. The final answer is cosine theta. Question 13, one over cosine theta over sine theta over cosine theta plus cosine theta over sine theta. Now multiply each side by sine theta cosine theta. To eliminate sine theta and cosine theta in the denominator. Expand. Cosine theta is cancelled. Sine theta over the first one, cosine theta is cancelled, then sine theta times sine theta is sine squared theta plus second one, sine theta is cancelled, then cosine theta times cosine theta is cosine squared theta equals sine theta over one, which is sine theta. This is the last one. We can factor first. Cosine theta is the common divisor. Then take out cosine theta. Then cotangent theta plus 1 over take out cotangent theta. Then 1 plus cotangent theta. Then common factor is cancelled. Cosine theta over cotangent theta, cosine theta times 1 over cotangent theta equals cosine theta times tangent theta, then cosine theta times sine theta over cosine theta, 
cancelled. The final answer is sign Sarah. I hope this video has been helpful. If you have any questions, leave them in a comment below. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe for more.